So here's the GPIO tone generator sample code. At the beginning, and this is provided by Randy Smith and Steve Euler. At the beginning, they were kind enough to put some really good uh, comments to describe what their intention is and how to generate a tone. Here's a tone map right at this area and a scale. The interesting part is in the init and run. At this point, we grab an instance of the demo board and now we're going to bind one of the pins on the demo board to the tone generator. We do that right here. I'm right here I'm binding to pin D1. And then all we do is we jump into a loop where we continually play these notes on a speaker. Um, and here are some helper methods that um, support the application. We're not going to use pause app or destroy app in this case. So let's look at the circuit a little bit. Great, so here's, this, here's our sunspot right here using our fancy uh, ribbon cable connector. And over here, even though it shows three connections, we're really only interested in two. This one here is going to pin D1, and from here it goes on to the breadboard. And this other connector down here is going to ground connection. And all they do is they they uh, connect into this speaker here, if you can see that. It's just a very um, common computer speaker. And uh, if we connect it up by hitting this wire, you can hear the tone. And actually, I don't think you can hear the tone because it's very light, but it goes something like, It's just again and again. But it's a very simple thing and it shows how easy it is to program something and get something working on the sunspot.